Taylor. I'm Krista. All right, first question. <clears throat> Where do you hang out on off, on, off. On, on off campus that allows you to relax and speak your mind? Off campus? Hmm. I mean, you can go to like speak your mind like on a mic, like stuff like that, or just like just chill. Yeah, sort of. nice. Like, you know, 356, that's a good place to kind of hang yeah. out. Yeah, you know? 356 so. is nice. Well, um, Wingin' is pretty alright. Yeah, when just it's when it's 10. not. Yeah, after 10. <laughs> when it's like not after 10. downtown. What about on campus? On campus. Mm -hmm. I used to go to the Hendrick Center. Hendrick like Center, yeah. Out. Student lounges, like in the different um, community, common buildings? Yeah, mm -hmm. common buildings yeah. and halls and stuff. So. Do y'all do attend church? Yes. yes. Alright, um, so with domination, what's something that is funny about your church? We go to a non-denominational church, so um, everybody's welcome. And um, let's see, one thing you funny about they say they say whatever they, they say like. whatever. <laughs> but the thing is, it's the truth. Like you know, it'll make you uncomfortable, but you need to hear it. You need to hear it. You know what I'm saying? So. No, no, no. Okay. How do y'all feel when y'all see stereotypes and minorities in the media? Uh, I, it, it makes me upset. Like I don't like ignorance and I don't like stereotypes. Like, oh, all black people can play sports. Or, like all black people are this. Or, all Asians are this. Like that. I feel like it's it's overrated. Like so many people stereotype us, and it's like we gotta live up to these stereotypes. And sometimes the stereotypes are beneath us, and people still try to make them make themselves lower to fit that stereotype. And I don't think we should be stereotyped at all. Oh, my name. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> Kendra Miller. Okay, Kendra. Um... Where do you hang out off campus that allows you to relax and speak your mind? Mm, off campus? Probably at a friend's house, friend's apartment. What about on campus? Uh, probably in the union or on the building. Uh, do you attend church? Yes. Uh, what domination and what's something that's funny about your church? Funny? Uh -huh. um, laugh a lot. <laughs> Our pastor makes jokes all the time. <laughs> right. How do you feel when you see stereotypes or minorities in the media? It depends on the stereotype that's being expressed. Um, I mean, how you feel about it? I think for some people it's they like the stereotype so people will keep using it on TV and on movies. Um, I don't think it's a good thing, I don't think it helps. Um, Stanley Hunter. Alright, Stanley. First question is, where do you hang out uh, off campus that allows you to relax and speak your mind? Uh, off campus, um, probably be at my apartment, just chilling with my boys. Alright, <laughs> and do you attend church? Yes, I do. Um, what's, what's the domination and what's something that's funny about your church? Um, this Baptist, whatever, and um, the, probably the funny thing about my church is, um, I guess how the young kids just really, really try to engage into church and try to act like act like the older people and stuff like that. But it's just a sign of how you know I'm saying they want to learn and you know what I'm saying become like the deacons and the preachers and stuff like that. So that's kind of funny to me watching little kids act like that. So. And how do you feel when you see stereotypes of my, minorities in the media? I mean, I think uh, I kind of laugh at it because that's just that's a sign of dumbness from people who just don't understand um, the lifestyles of some people and stuff like that. You can't judge somebody about what they do just because you don't do it. So I don't really let it bother me as much because it's not directly towards me, but I just look at it and uh, kind of just blow it off because it's, it's a sign of ignorance. Will Schuler. All right, well, um, first question. When do you hang out off campus that allows you to relax and speak your mind? Um, I guess me and some of my friends go out to the, uh, what's that place? It's a place called up in Anderson. It's like where you can uh, shag and do whatever, and they let us go in there. We can choose what songs we like. So, uh, I guess it's about the best thing I can think of right now. Okay. All right, do you attend church? I do. Um, so, what domination and what's funny about your church? Um, 
I'm a Baptist. And uh, you said what's funny? Like what's funny about your church? Yeah. Okay. Um, my pastor's pretty funny. Alright. <laughs> and how do you feel when you see stereotypes or minorities in the media? Um, I don't think that's fair. Um, stereotypes. It's, uh, it's not good to stereotype people, of course. And, um, I just try to look at it if I was the one being stereotyped. Try not to treat others that way. Name, please. Reggie Simpson. All right, Reggie, first question. What do you hang out off campus that allows you to relax and speak your mind? Um, I go by and I visit one of my buddies that I grew up with. He'll come to my house, I'll go to his house. Church, and probably going to visit my brother in Atlanta. All right, All right so now that I know you go to church, uh, what's, what domination is your church and what's something that's funny about your church? Um, my, the, the denomination is Baptist. Something funny about my church. Hmm. Something funny about it. Something funny about my church is that my pastor had a glass eye. Would, would, that, would that be considered something funny about it? <laughs> and sometimes when he preaches, his eye falls out and he pulls it. No. <laughs> Go ahead. Uh, uh, <laughs> Third question. How do you feel when you see stereotypes of minorities in the media? Um, sometimes it makes me upset, you know, because I think the media does play some negative stereotypes on them. But then sometimes I feel that you know, minorities, they put themselves in a position to make the media stereotype them. So I think minorities have to do a better job of not living up to those stereotypes because the media is going to do what they want to do anyway. They're going to push what they want to push, the, the topics that they want to push. But uh, minorities, like I said, they have to make sure that they're not living up to those stereotypes. Karen Countryman. All right, first question, Karen. Where do you hang out? off campus that allows you to relax and speak your mind? I hang out with my eight-year-old son. Right. And I speak my mind often with him. <laughs> <laughs> All right, do you attend church? I do. All right, um, so what's the domination and what's something that is funny about your church? It is non-denominational. It's New Spring in Anderson. Um, and my pastor is hilarious. <laughs> yeah. You must go there. Or been there. Yeah. All right. How do you feel when you see stereotypes of minorities in the media? I don't like it. I don't like people to have a stereotype. I don't think it's right because everybody's an individual and they should be treated as such. I shouldn't be treated one way because of my skin color. You shouldn't be, or your hair color, or anything like that. Right. I just I don't like it. All right. Sometimes I speak up. It depends on the crowd that I'm with. Okay. Right. Like if I know them and I'm comfortable enough to say something, right. I will say something. If not, I just, I probably should, but I don't speak up.